Hi guys, this is Coach Sean with Track Athletics. I'm the Director of Athlete Performance. I'm here to talk to you about the three reasons why muscle confusion is slowing your results. All right, number one, muscle confusion does not exist. All right, that is a term for marketing from Tony Horton, uh, P90X, from boot camps, from fit bodies, from everything else, guys. Uh, it's not a real thing. Your muscles have never been confused in their life. Your brain just tells them what to do, to contract or to relax. Right? That's the only two things that the muscles know how to do. So at the end of the day, uh, that's all they're going to do. Right? What you want to do is think about what's happening though. Right? The biggest point here is that your results are going to be slowed if you keep trying to confuse those muscles. Right? That constant variation uh, is not going to help quick results. It's not going to help you out in the long haul. Imagine, uh, ladies, you're trying to build those glutes up and you throw in some bench that day, you throw in some pulls, you throw in some presses, you work all these upper body things. What haven't you grown? What haven't you worked on? Those glutes, right? If you keep confusing it with all these other things around it, it's not gonna confuse the glutes. They're just not getting work that day, all right? So we wanna make sure that's a thing. And number three, right? Success leaves clues, guys. Uh, if Olympians, like Lauren Bay Regula here at Track Athletics, don't constantly confuse it, they do blocks of the same sort of training over and over before switching to the next thing, I think that's probably how you should do it as well. Not that you gotta go to their level, but you do need to take the things, the consistency out of that and work with it. Guys, keep following us, like, subscribe, comment, get it going.